Hi, my name is Rob Durham and I'm the Director of Scientific Support for Gyros Protein Technologies in North America. The current focus for our organization is to develop nanoliter scale immunoassays uh, for bioanalytical development and, and drug development. Uh, at WRIB this year, we've uh, uh, launched a new uh, refresh of our XP platform. We've, uh, we have uh, the, what's called the Gyrolab Expand, which offers the possibility of having sample cooling, temperature control. It also gives us uh, more control over the mixing and matching of different types of methods and analytical uh, methods that can be run on, this, on the system at the same time. The impact for us on uh, regulated bioanalysis, we think, will, will drive improvements in efficient and robust assay development uh, and validation. It'll minimize sample volume and reagent usage, as well as degradation due to sample stability issues. This will lead to an improvement in overall uh, data quality and, and, and uh, uh, fast assay turnaround. The Gyrolab is also, can also be used in other areas of biologics development like um, uh, in discovery and preclinical uh, drug development as well as CMC manufacturing and bioprocess. We're currently expanding our menu of tools to support bioprocess with kits for titer and host cell contaminants as well as a new module to allow for the development or the measurement of affinity. There's a lot of excitement when there's something new to look at. Uh, most of our existing users have asked for the possibility of temperature control, so adding cooling to the new platform has generated a lot of interest. The more flexible run design and execution with our new assay manager has uh, delivered on some key functionality that our customers have requested over the years. Some of the key hurdles that Gyrolab has, overcome, has allowed uh, the, us to overcome is, a, is it's really delivered on a user-friendly tool that has enabled customers to do more with less sample volume, which drives efficiency. Speed of analysis that ensures we can make timely data-driven decisions and uh, deliver safe drugs to patients at a lower cost. This is a great meeting because it generates a robust discussion between the scientific community, the solution providers, and the regulators. You really get a sense that we're all working together to deliver innovative treatments to our patients.